Hi, John here. We're going to explain today how a cooling water system for an engine works and I'm going to try and do it in about a minute. So we've got a cross section of an engine. We can see that there's an engine cooling water pump. That's this area here. The pump discharges to a thermostat, which is this item here. And essentially what the thermostat is going to do, it's either going to circulate the cooling water back to the engine when the cooling water is too cold but when the engine is hot, it's going to circulate to the radiator to cool it down. So let's see that in action. I'm going to speed it up a little bit. So the cooling water is cold, so it's going through the bottom of the thermostat. So this lower valve is open and the water is forced this way and it is essentially bypassing the radiator. And because the engine is running and the cooling water system is just circulating through the engine, the cooling water system is actually going to heat up. The fluid is going to become warmer and warmer and warmer until we reach a desired temperature of maybe 80 or 85 degrees. However, when we've reached this temperature of 80, 85 degrees, we then need to change the system slightly. We don't want to keep increasing the temperature. We don't want to keep circulating the cooling water. What we actually want to do then is use the radiator. We need to cool the cooling water down to maintain this temperature. And that's essentially what's going to happen here. The thermostat has changed position. This is now closed. The lower valve is closed and the hot cooling water is going this way. So this time it's flowing to the radiator. The white arrows here indicate air. Air is passing over the radiator. It's removing some of the heat and it's cooling the cooling water system down. We can see here the arrows at the bottom of the radiator are now blue. It's cooled the cooling water system down to the desired temperature and it's going back to the engine. And the thermostat will essentially open or close depending on the cooling water system temperature. We'll see this valve again. If it's cold, the valve in the bottom is open. If it is hot, then the valve in the top is open. And the thermostat controls the temperature of the engine by controlling if the radiator is bypassed or not. And that is how a cooling water system on an engine works.